Ukrainian farmers praise the signed grain export deal but express concerns about implementation A farmer from Zaporizhia told CNN he felt positively about the deal signed between Russia and Ukraine to unblock Black Sea ports for exporting grains, but he said he was weary of its implementation. We will watch and observe what will happen. It's good that they signed. But there are no results yet, Pavlo Seryenko said on Friday. The price will be higher in the ports, but you still have to get there. We need to hire a car, logistics, etc. What will be the cues? How to go? Thousands of checkpoints. I'm generally an optimist, but the reality is that there's not much in what you can believe now. But of course, we will hope that it is all for the better," he added. Seryenko went on to say that in his area, being able to export grain was only one of a million problems. Friday, there were two strikes again, and the wheat field burned again, and the fertilizer warehouse was destroyed. All the fertilizer was spilled on the ground, and it dissolves very quickly. After the rain, about five to six tons melted. Something must be done, he said. Here, we mow under fire, sometimes in one field, then in another, because we are afraid that it will hit the people and the harvester. A farmer from Mykolaiv told CNN that the deal signed is important but he does not want it come at the expense of any military concessions to Moscow from Kiev. For us, it is absolutely necessary. Our warehouses and elevators are full of grain. The grain of the last harvest, the grain of this harvest, Mikhail Trokimovic said. But we should sign this treaty only if we do not make any military concessions to Russia.